Gypsies, welcome back to my channel. Um, happy Sunday. So it's Sunday. It's nice and quiet up here in my alternate filming spot. There's nobody here. I got a great sun place and just want to say welcome back. If you're new to my channel, um, a lot of people call me Gypsy. Uh, my name's Sherry. I'll answer to anything. So yes. So anyway, welcome. So I got a Dollar Tree haul here and yeah. My whole back seat is filled with Dollar Tree stuff, so I've got enough for about probably three more hauls back there, but I'll still be going to the Dollar Tree in the meantime just to see if they put out more stuff. There's things on my wish list, things I'm looking for, so if I don't get them when they put them out, you know how that goes. If you miss them, you miss them, and I don't want to take that chance, so I'll probably be going tomorrow to a couple of Dollar Trees just in my area, just to, just to see, you know, if they put out my wish list. So anyway, I'm going to start with this one right on top. There might be a little bit of Boro in here, but there's good stuff too. So first off, I got these bad boys right here. Um, I don't know if they had these last year or not. Wait a minute. I got a niche. Okay. So I don't know if they had these last year or not. Um, the ones I found, there was two different ones that I saw. There might have been one that was more of a... Maybe a, a, a gold, like a slash gold olive green, you know, no, kind of a drab looking that I may not have got just because it was kind of a drab looking. But these two right here, I think they're gorgeous. I don't know. They may have had these last year. I don't remember them for some reason though. I love them because I love sunflowers. So I think my love of sunflowers though is just growing like every year. Like it's one of my favorite, like decorating, decorating things um but yes i absolutely love these so i just got one of each of those okay and then i also let's see here i got one of each of these in the two different colors this is the creepy cloth this stuff is so amazing last year me and fifi made which is my daughter we made witches we used a milk jug and we used this as the uh as her cape slash witch dress or whatever and it looked so cool I, I, I would I would I don't know I would I was gonna say I would love to do it again but I still have mine hanging in the garage I think I'm gonna have to pull that sucker out though this year and get it back out because it's just so cute and yeah this can be used for so many different things though not even Halloween related really there I'm sure there's a lot of different different Look, look at it hanging there. It just looks creepy, you know? It looks creepy. So that's a good thing. That's a fun thing to decorate with. And then I got these pumpkins here. Let's see, I did get a few little, okay. So this is the only ones in this bag. So these are just the golden orange slash, golden slash orange with black polka dots. I think these are cute and I think these will look cute sitting on a tiered tray. I'm, I'm working on my tiered tray slowly but surely as I bring stuff in, you know, from the Dollar Tree that I've gotten. So I still have things in bags that I haven't shown you guys yet. And whenever I get my tiered tray all done, it is built. We'll put it that way. It's built and I do have a couple things on there. So as soon as I get everything done, I will take a picture and show you guys. So I'll probably put it on Instagram and probably here too, just YouTube on a post. But I think these right here is going to be perfect for that tiered tray. You can even make a spooky tiered tray with some creepy cloth. Hmm, that's interesting. That's interesting. Um, here's just a couple packs of gum for my hubby and my son. Um, let me show you this because I thought that these were cute and these would be really cute on the tear tray as well. Now question, okay, so these are little acorn candles. Okay, look at the blue. It owns my heart this year, it really does. I love it. So we got a blue acorn with a gold top gnome hat whatever and then we have the burnt orange color which is gorgeous i absolutely love it but would you leave them wrapped up or would you unwrap them they, they do have a cute bow tie on there so would you leave them wrapped would you unwrap them that's just my question i'm just curious about that so let me know guys let me know what you would do about that like i don't know and then i found some more candles okay they're adorbs but they don't really smell that great i mean 
Well, let me smell them again. Maybe my sniffer was off that day, but, and they're not melted, which is a good thing because they've been in my hot car. So let me show you guys and let me re-smell. So first off, we have this one right here, which is a wild cherry. First off, look at this packaging. I absolutely love this. So this is a wild cherry candle. I love, I just love the whole looks of it. So cute. Now I'm going to smell it again. I don't know. I can't, I can't decide. I don't think I like it. I just don't think I like it. But the candle is just so darn cute. So just to burn it, I don't really, I mean, that, their candles don't really put out a ton of scent anyway, if you know what I mean. But just to burn this candle, I think would be really cute. So I grabbed that one. And then they have this one here. Okay. Vanilla Shake. So, yes, Vanilla Shake. And I had not seen these yet. So, I don't know if they've been out a while or if they're new or whatever. But I had not seen them. So, yes, Vanilla Shake. Let me smell. <laughs> okay. My first smell scent was not even vanilla. It smelled like my mother-in-law's old perfume. Yeah. Second scent, I did get a little bit of vanilla and old perfume. So, I just don't know. I don't know how I feel about these candles. Like, if I light that up and it smells like my mother-in-law's old perfume, boom baby trash. Boom baby trash. Okay, and then last but not least, we have this blue raspberry. Look how cute it is. Let me take the lid off and show you, like, up close and personal there. Blue raspberry. I'm kind of afraid let's see okay hold on I get a blue raspberry I get a blue raspberry pretty strong this one might not be that bad guys it might not be that vanilla though I don't know but anyway blue raspberry so I thought that was a cute little trio that was the only three that I saw if you guys know if there's more let me know because I'll be on the lookout just for a little collection they'd be cute like lit all at the same time you know just I don't know a summery type ice cream dill thing. Okay, let me get into this Boro bag down here. I mean, it's not too Boro. I mean, it's Boro, but you know, boring. Um, okay, so we have, I just need some more baggies, some more gallon size bags. This is the Good Sense. This is the um, extra, you get two extra sacks. Um, a zipper seal. They're not freezer or anything like that. So it's just gallon bags. I use gallon bags all the time. So, yes. So, hold on one second, and then we'll get right back into this. Okay, here we go. Uh, yeah, gallon bags. So, I'm, I'm always needing gallon bags. for. Usually, it's a head of lettuce that I've cut up or cut, and I still have half a head left, and I just stick it in a, one of those, and yeah. And then I got these for my son. He absolutely loves these, um, and I love that they put them in a different a different box. It just makes them seem brand new to me. <laughs> but it is the chocolate chip muff mini muffins. And you only get three packs in here, but he really likes them. He thinks they're really good. So he ate all the last ones that I bought, which I can't remember if I bought one or two boxes, but yeah. So he had those. And then I also got this for him just to try because I thought it looked interesting. So this is the Caruso's Dark Cream. It's Italian style soda. I did see that they had a lot of different kinds of these. So maybe I'll try to get him one every now and then. I did see like uh, the cream soda, which was a really a lot lighter than this, but this is just like dark. And I'm just, it, I, I, I feel like it's gonna be like really good and it's actually chilled. It got down to probably 68 or 67 last night. So it's kind of chilled, so yeah. I'll give him that when I get home, and it'll be cold for him already. Okay, let's dive into another bag. So, I got a couple of signs, and they had a couple more of these, but these are the only two that really appealed to me. So, I'm like, I'm not going to get them all, but I do like these, and I love, first off, I love the looks of it, okay? I love the wooden background here, but I feel like it was really hard to find, um, and this is crooked, to find one that was not crooked. If you can see, do you see how crooked like the, the white layer right here is? Now, I don't know if I can pull that off and reposition it, 
I don't know how easy that would be, but if you can see, it looks like there's a little bit, see where it, it looks like it has a little bit of dried glue right there? I don't know. I may try, but I don't know. I really love it. It says pumpkins, leaves, fall, hay rides, cider, harvest, and blessings. So, make sure I don't have any lipstick on my teeth. But anyway, I like the looks of it, so I went ahead and grabbed that. And then I also, whoop, whoop, hold on. I dropped it, I dropped it. Um, this one right here, and this one is a little bit crooked as well. Like I said, it was hard to find one that wasn't. It actually evidently was impossible. This one says fall, caramel apples, scarecrows, crisp breeze, falling leaves, pumpkins, cider, bonfires, hay rides, and harvest. So all of the wonderful things about fall is right here, baby. Boom. And they had another one or maybe even two, but I don't know. I didn't think they looked, I don't know. I just didn't care for the looks of them. So here is, oh, here's a corn cob. Okay, yes, this is definitely going to go on my tiered tray, but I have some more corn. I was I was just remembering, I have some more corn cobs that I showed you guys the other day that's a two-pack that are, like, super heavy, and, like, I don't know if they're, like, real glass beads on them. I haven't opened them up yet, but I think they are going to be, like, really pretty as well on the tiered tray, but this one is really cute as well, but you only get one for a dollar, and I've got pieces falling off of it. So I've got to be very careful. This right here, I'm telling you, looks like real corn corn silk. I really think it is. And it just says decor, but I think it's really pretty, you know. I don't know. Is, is the colors coming through? It's just such a really pretty color. It's Indian corn, and I don't know why they call it Indian corn, but I just really was loving it. And then this right here for the tiered tray as well. I think this is beautiful. Like, I'm going to have so many pumpkins on my tiered tray. I don't know, and, and once I start putting things on, I'll probably like change my mind 50 times, but I really like the looks of that pumpkin, how it's darker on the top, and then it gets lighter on the bottom, and it's just really, really pretty, so it's sparkly. It's sparkly, too, where you can't, you can't go wrong with a sparkly pumpkin, right? No. Okay, and then, boom. We have another, and I can't remember if I hauled this color. So, like I said, I was going to a lot of different stores, and I was getting these pumpkins. I know I don't have the royal purple, but I don't even know if it's out yet. It might come out in the Halloween stuff. But I'm, I, I, I feel like I've got one that I was calling, it's got that glue on it, uh, that I was calling like a charcoal looking. So I don't know if it's the same one or not. It could be, but if it is, I could just put like one on each side of a bookshelf or, you know, something like that um, just to match them up there. But I think that's a really pretty color. And yeah, I have no idea how many I have. Like, And then I just got these right here. And these are just for, I may put them on the tray. I actually already have some leaves on the tray. The ones that I showed you guys the other day that had like the foil look, like the lacy, sparkly ones every now and then. But this right here, these two together, I mean, like not even taking them apart, like would be really, really pretty on the bottom shelf of that tray. And this is just setting pumpkins like on top. I just think these fall leaves are just gorgeous, but these are two different colors. So let me show you. So we have the more reddish and like when fall time comes and all of the leaves are changing, like those are like my favorite color to see. They're almost like an, a, an electric orangey red, I don't know, neon. Oh, this is three packs, guys. So we have that one and then we have two of these. And I think I actually had in mind these for my mailbox out front because these pretty much are the same so these and i might just use all three of them for my mailbox i don't know since i already have leaves on my tiered tray i might just go ahead and use all these on my mailbox but look how beautiful they are oh my goodness they're just they're just so beautiful i can't i just can't they're just so pretty oh Somebody asked me, before I forget, because I forget, um, this my steering wheel cover. Let me, okay. Oh, you can't really see all that well, but it's a very blingy. It's, it's like, it looks like diamonds. Um, somebody had asked me a couple of different times to show my steering wheel cover, and believe me, it took an act of Congress to get this on the steering wheel, but what saved me was, number one, I put it out in the, uh, up here in the dash and let the sun beat down on it for... 
I mean, like, it came, the sun came up, and then by the time I got to the car, probably a good six or seven hours, and then it still took an act of Congress, but I finally got it on, and let me just say, I was so excited. I had my son try, I had my daughter try, I had my husband try. Nobody could get it on, so I'm like, I will get that on, because they're like, no, it doesn't fit. It's not going to fit. I'm like, it's going to fit, and it fits like a glove, um, but anyway, it's sparkly. I got it off Amazon. If you look in the description box on my Amazon favorites of this video, Amazon favorites, I do have the steering wheel cover linked, so you can click right on there, and you can find it, and if you have Amazon, I don't know if it's Amazon Prime or just Amazon account in general, if you put your car, what kind of car you have, um, it will tell you like any parts, any car seat covers, floor mats, anything you buy, it will let you know if it will fit your car. So I think that's a really cool thing. But it told me that this was going to fit my car. So that's how I knew it was going to fit. So I'm like, you're fitting, baby. And it's, I love it. I absolutely love it. I love the feel of it when I'm driving. Like, I mean, it's not rough, it's smooth, but it's gorgeous, and it catches the sunlight sometimes, and it just sparkles. So anyway, I just wanted to do that for the person or people that had asked me to show that and tell me where, tell you guys where I got it. So, yes. Okay, so let me, I'm going to put these just right over top of that. <laughs> okay, guys. Uh, oh, kind of afraid to pull these out. I'm wanting to do like um, a fall and I, do, I already have some flowers just for a vase or like one of those tall skinny metal buckets that they have. I actually just took my spring flowers out of there. So I'm wanting to do like a fall flower thing in there. So I got these. Uh, these actually are Halloween decor though, but I think with fall flowers, that these would look so pretty up in there. They're very sparkly and the color that burnt orange and I just think that they'd look really, really good up in a fall collection of flowers. So yes, that is actually what I'm planning on using them for. This is two different ones. So yeah, and it just says branch. It's a branch. So, but these kind of things, the glitter tends to really fall off. So I'm gonna stick that right back down in there. Okay. I'm just going to get the one on top just to make it simpler. All right, so let me just start. Oh, what am I going to do with myself? Like, what am I going to do with myself? I can't quit buying stuff like this. Like, why? I bought three more. These are sketchbooks. Oh, wait. <clears throat> I bought these. Let me just say. <clears throat> Let me turn this down. Um, I bought these two and I showed them in the last video. So that means I've got duplicates of these. How ridiculous is that? My memory is pretty grim. It is. It's pretty grim because like... Alright, so when I do my coloring book giveaways when I hit 13k... Um, I'll be including sketchbooks in there as well, just because, and I'm hoping to do at least three winners on the coloring book giveaways. There will be several adult coloring books in the giveaways and a sketchbook each. So, <laughs> yes. So, yeah. And I got those three colors there. They're just so colorful and pretty and yeah. So, I have nowhere absolutely to put anything right now. Just, just chill back there, okay? Just chill. Hold on. All right. Got it. Okay. So, I got this. Um, I got... Okay. So, these are separate ones. And these are just window decorations. I like to put them on my um, fridge or on my dishwasher. Just anywhere like that. Just to make pretty, you know, to make, to make it look fall. I love these. I love these. They look like falling leaves. Um, there are some green ones up in there, um, but I love all of the different colors, and I just think these are really, really pretty. So, I got that one, and then I got this one right here, and, like, this is the pumpkin, the gourds. You got some vines over here. I just think these are so pretty, and these are just so perfect for, like, refrigerators and dishwashers and windows, of course, or mirrors. You know, if you have a big mirror and you have a little extra room, that would be really pretty just for the fall season. So, yes did that and then 
I got these for when I make my purple wreath and I just think that I don't know if I'm gonna use them on that or not maybe just to set on my shelf whenever I do do it for Halloween these are very sparkly beautiful spiders how many times have you heard that? What a beautiful spider that is. <laughs> what a gorgeous spider. But like, these are sparkly. I mean, I can dig a sparkly. Now, if spiders were sparkly in real life, I would still not like them. I'm sure of it. Um, I just got some Halloween stickers. And this is just, um, like, usually they have Halloween stickers. But I do know that they are coming out, and they're probably out already, with some gorgeous, like, fall stickers, like, special, really special. But this is what I, I found already, so I went ahead and grabbed one of each. So, let me just hold them up and show you guys. They're just like the normal little cute, cutesy Halloween stickers. And I just wanted to get one of each. I love this one. Look at that little witchy poo cooking up some brew. Look at that little owl. What's, what's that blue? Oh, that's not an owl. That's a Frankenstein. That's a Frankenstein. Like, I can't see. I thought it was an owl wrapped in a blue cloth. What is that? Okay. And then these right here with little googly eyes. I'll probably just give these to Jack just to, you know, fool around with her little sketch pad and stuff. She can put those on there and draw a castle in the background or whatevs. And then this one right here. I love the, the castle there. The ghost. I'll probably give these all to her, actually. <laughs> and then this one right here. This is the um, foil stickers. I like the looks of these. I guess because they kind of look rainbowish or tie dyedish or whatever. And I know it's probably really difficult for you to see these with that reflection, but those are super cute. So yes. And then I also got these right here, and I did get one of each of these because I always like these every single year. I don't know. So, um, last year, I put them on my grapevine tree with some purple and orange lights, and they were just really cute, and you know, so they have diff three different, well, I think they actually have more than, more than this, but these are the three that kind of appealed to me. I love that second one there with the spider web on it, and these are very glittery as well, if you can see. So I got that one, and then I got this one. I like the big eye. So there's a green eye and there's an orange eye and then the, the purple. And you can even just take all the sparkly purple and the sparkly black out and just put on a tree if you want. But I love the orange with the spider webs as well. So I think those are all really, really cute. So yes, um, and I don't know if I'll put them on my tree or not. I do have some garland somewhere and I may just hang them on garland just to decorate the house up. So we'll see, we'll see how that goes. Um, let me show you this because I broke one. So the other day I was, or yesterday actually, I have, I had all this stuff in my trunk and like I had to go pick up a click list order from Walmart. So I had to take all the stuff out of the trunk and put it in my back seat so they could put my groceries in the trunk. So in the process of doing all that, I dropped this bag and I heard that sound, the sound of breakage, yes. So let me show you the one that didn't break. And I'm like, please don't let this be one I really, really love, you know, because like no matter how good they wrap it, you drop it on asphalt, it's breaking. Yeah, well, maybe not, but you know, um, this is very pretty. This is very pretty. Just a little pumpkin. I love the leaf on it. I love that they have a little bit of green in the leaf. So that pretty much tells me what the other one is that broke. It sounds pretty grim, doesn't it? Let me just see, maybe hold up a piece so you guys can maybe identify which one. Oh, this thing really broke too. <laughs> oh my gosh, you know. You know how it goes. So it was this one, the cream colored one. I don't know. I, th I feel like if it, one had to break, I would have wished it would have been the pump, the, the orange one. Because look how, how good that leaf stands out on this one and the stem and just the cream color. I may find another one to replace it, but oopsie daisy, it broke. That's okay. That's all right. We'll just deal with it. Okay, and then all right, so I showed you guys, I think I already showed, 
I remember showing it in a walkthrough. I may have gotten two of these, but I wouldn't be I wouldn't be sad if I did get two of these because these are gorgeous. So this is the Happy Harvest, not a walkthrough. My fave from that one video that me and Fifi did the vlog. Um, I know I showed this on that. So it says Happy Harvest, and it has the blue pumpkin. Oh my gosh, look at it! And it has sunflowers. It's just gorgeous. It's just gorgeous. Like I loved it. I loved it. So I got that, and then um. I got these for Jack. Um, Ellen had sent her some the other day, a blue and a red one, and they had like the forks and stuff. I already had these purchased at that time though. So I just got a zombie green color. You know, I love my zombie green. And then bright pink, I love these colors together. So they're just called lunch trays. But this I love because they have like a lot of different compartments for the kids that don't like stuff to touch. You know, they have a lot of different compartments and I love these, honestly. Because the ones that she has now, she's had them since she was like a baby. Like totally. Like like they are very old and like they're small. And these are much more like she's almost eight. So these are going to be, you know, way more like, you know, big enough for her. The other ones were a little crowded. So, yeah. And then I got this water bottle. It looks tie-dyed. I loved it. It's BPA-free. Um, let me just see. What, what, what kind of drink? And so you just unscrew the lid and drink or whatever. But I think this is a really pretty tie-dyed looking. And I think they had different colors um, that I've seen, but I didn't have not seen in person. And this was the only one that I had seen in person. So I'm like, I like this. I like the rubbery grip that it has on it. And it's just a really cute water bottle. So I've always been kind of a sucker for water bottles. I have. And then I found the two scents that I had not found before. Um, French Mist and Calming Light. So these were on my wish list to find. I had already found the... Um, can't remember what this is called but I'm putting these up until winter until I use heat because like the heat is gonna make them smell a whole lot better than the air does so yes I'm just gonna put these up I don't know why they look different like look look at the, the packaging like totally I mean like this is a lot bigger that's weird isn't it huh anyway I was glad to have found those I may share with my son as well. Okay, and so I got two of these. As you guys know, I am doing the giveaways. Uh, when I hit 14K, I'm doing a beauty giveaway. So I am currently saving um, all the makeup that I get for those beauty giveaways. So these, I think I gave these in my last beauty giveaways as well. And I have one of these that I really, really like. So this is the Maybelline Color Sensational. Um, lip gloss. It says, bring on the glam with this high shine lip gloss. And this is in the color Mocha Amazing. And this color is pretty Mocha Amazing. I absolutely love it. And then sometimes you feel like wearing a flat lipstick. Sometimes you feel like wearing, not a flat, that's a paint, a matte. <laughs> A matte lipstick or sometimes you want to be glossy babe so these are when the time these are for the times you want to be glossy girl be glossy girl okay and then these planner stickers I love them I think they're really great I love putting stickers in my planner um, just you know, it, even if it doesn't make sense to put, you know, I just like to go through the planner and any empty spots that I find, I like to stick stickers just to make it more fun and more colorful and just, you know, I just love these. So there's what you get. So this is the Let's Planner and these are Greenbrier product, um, but I just, I, I really loved them. And they have another one too, I think I got. So you get these pages, you get 375 pieces. And if you think you can't use these in a happy planner, you're crazy. You can use these in any planner that you have. Dollar Tree planner, happy planner, whatever else there is. You can use them anywhere. And then I was happy to find these again. I got two last time. And these things are just so perfect just for small items. 
honestly, this one right here is for my husband's toolbox for like his little screws or any little tiny things. And, and like there's space for bigger things as well. So I just think these are a really good deal. They're trifold peel and storage box and these are not Dollar Tree brand. These are really good made and I really like them. And so I was really hoping to find another one. So I did. And then last but not least in this bag is the Extra Strength Back and Body Aspirin, NSAID and Caffeine Pain Reliever. Um, so these are extra strength. I don't know, let me see if I can see what the difference is from my other one because we couldn't figure it out. They both say extra strength, but they were in two different colors of bottle of bottles. Like this one has purple. Um, so they're both caplets. They both have 24 pain reliever aid. Aspirin and said, do they both have caffeine? Yes. Compared to Bayer Back and Body. Compared to Bayer Back and Body. I don't know. Unless they change the packaging, these things are the bomb.com. Let me just say, they help a whole lot with my joint pain. And my just regular body pain. My neck pain. My, my neck pain. Yes. Yes. Okay. Guess what? I got more, more velvet pumpkins. Let me show you guys. Oh, first off, let me show you these because I just now showed you some. And I'm finally, I knew I had more. And I'm finally getting to find them. So, the little pillows, guys. The little pillows. What I do with the little pillow, it's probably under here somewhere. Yes, I'm sure it is. But anyway, they have these as well. I love because the back looks like burlap. So these are the other two that I saw. So this one says give thanks. And it's just, you know, just hang on the doorknob or, or wherever. Uh, grateful hearts gather here. So I love these this year. I don't remember these last year. I honestly do not. So... I'm loving that they have those out. And I'm loving that I actually found them. And I know that I have duplicate signs and stuff. So that is something I'm going to have to deal with. Um, but my son um, and his girlfriend, Hallie, I know that they'll take any duplicates that I have. So they can fix their place up really cute too. So here's some more velvet pumpkins. And I absolutely am positive I have a burnt, a burnt orange already. But that's okay. Here's the blue I've been talking about. It's not really a blue. It's like... um turquoise turquoise come here it's trying to jump um that's gorgeous right so this is the blue i guess this is the blue and this is the turquoise okay so and then i got this gorgeous maroon one Whoop, come here come here girl i think i have duplicates of that as well i'm pretty sure and then last but not least we have the gold the gold so, these colors here. Gorgeous, right? And then, of course, I have my burnt orangey. Yeah, I love these. And then I also have, like, the, um, what is it? Like, a dusty rose color. So, yes. Okay. All right. There's those. There's those. Okay. Next, I got this. Just because I think it's gorgeous. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with it. But this is absolutely beautiful. I know you can make beautiful bows with this. But all you crafters out there. What's a good use for this? To, to just make something pretty. Like I know you're going to say wrap it around vases. Which would be a really good. And I saw something so cool over on TikTok. Guys. Uh, next time I go to the Dollar Tree. I'm going to get it. And I'm going to show you guys. And you guys are going to flip out. So cool. Looky here. This is when Fifi was with me. This is a G. I was trying to find an S for Sherry, but I found a G for Gypsy instead. And I love this one because it looks like the real wood. I absolutely love this one. Yes. So grab that and then a couple of more signs. And these I'm pretty sure I already have. Well, I know I have this one. So this one's going to go to my son. And then this one here, I have not, I do not have this one. Always be thankful. I love the mason jar shape of it. And I love the wreath on there with the gorgeous um, fall leaves and the pumpkins. 
always be thankful so that is one of my favorites let me just say one of my favorites so pretty and then last but not least let me show you these can you hear that okay first off i have this one which i'm pretty sure i have a duplicate of this because i cannot remember what i got that's pretty bad isn't it but anyway like i said my son and his girlfriend will gladly take any of, the, of, of these. Um, I also got Boom Baby, that one there. Um, the reason I got this, I feel like I had this one last year, but I feel like they changed it up a little bit and put a, a, a metal leaf on it. I don't remember the metal leaf. I love that there's green and red apples and it just says farm fresh and then it says bless and it has some sunflowers on there. So like this is like everything. Like it has everything you need for fall and harvest and yeah, all that fun stuff. And then, look what I found. I found the metal signs, guys. Okay, I thought I had two of these. Okay, apparently I only found one metal blue truck. And look at the blue pumpkin in the back, guys. Look at the distressed look. It says thankful. This is probably my favorite sign, okay? And then this one right here. This is a wagon. This is metal as well. I love the blue pumpkin. And it says farm fresh pumpkins look at that i love the metal signs i really do and i ended up getting two of these the farm fresh pumpkin the wagons yes so they are absolutely gorgeous i love them i'm so excited to get to decorating for fall i'm just so happy about that i'm just i just love it I love it. I always will. And I know you guys do too. So like pumpkin scented everything, pumpkin flavored everything. Yes, please. I'm ready. I'm just ready. Like I see a few leaves are turning. I'm in. Like let's do this. Let's do this fall thing, right? Okay, guys. I just want to say thank you so much for watching my video. Um, let me know um, if you stay till the end. Just curious. Also, if you're not subscribed to my channel, please hit that subscribe button. Give me a thumbs up and leave me a comment down below, guys. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.